I mean, remind me, to, to, to what extent do, say, loan covenants still require companies to obtain gap-based financial statements? I, I, I guess I'm asking you, are lenders and creditors and minority shareholders sympathetic, or are they suspicious when it comes to ACBOA? Jeff, I think they're both. Uh, there's an array of third parties out there that recognize the cost issues associated with gap statements recognize that a lot of the gap pronouncements of recent years are really not applicable to private companies in the same way they're applicable to public companies. And they also recognize that uh, the, the entity itself may not have the sophisticated folks in-house you know, in to do a lot of that work. So to force them to go outside, pay you know, expensive rates to have folks do this, I think there's a, there's, a, there's a group of third parties that acknowledges this, you know, acknowledges this issue, recognizes it, and is sympathetic, and is willing to accept an alternative, uh, you know, with certain caveats in terms of collateral values and things like that. They're willing to accept an alternative. There's another group of third parties that isn't quite as sympathetic. They believe gap is gap and gap is gap, and they think gap is what should always be presented, because how can you have anything different than generally accepted accounting principles. So I think there's a, there's a mix taking place. I think there's also some geographic issues here. Uh, the Northeast tends to like gap a lot, and you see a lot more gap presentations in the Boston, New York, Philadelphia, Washington corridor. As you move west, you see a lot of gap in large cities, you know, in Chicago, in Detroit, et cetera. But when you get into the smaller cities throughout the Midwest, you find a lot of tax basis presentations. As you get into the Southwest, a lot of tax basis presentations. Then we, we move into the California, Washington area. Certainly the larger cities have a lot of gap, but in, in the areas outside of the larger cities, you see a lot of tax basis presentations. So I think there's a, ge a geographic mix happening here too. And I think some of the more local community banks, for example, tend to be more understanding of a tax basis presentation, uh, whereas some of your larger banks, your national banks, international banks, are a little bit less sympathetic.